हेलो जेंस वेलकम टू द कंप्लीट स्ट्रेटजी फॉर बिटसेट 2022 ट्रस्ट मी दिस वीडियो हैज एवरीथिंग यू नीड टू नो टू क्रैक बिटसेट 2022 फ्रॉम कंप्लीटिंग योर सिलेबस टू गिविंग मॉक टेस्ट लिटरली एवरीथिंग आल्सो जस्ट अ फुट नोट आई वुड नॉट रेकमेंड दिस वीडियो टू समबडी हु इज वेल प्रिपेयर्ड और हु इज एट लीस्ट ऑन द राइट ट्रैक दिस वीडियो इज फॉर दोस हु आर स्टार्टिंग देयर प्रिपरेशन फ्रॉम जीरो हु आर स्टार्टिंग नाउ विद देयर प्रिपरेशन okay so those who are well prepared with their syllabus you can directly skip to the revision and the mock test part that might help you and those who are starting from zero let's begin so step 1 is to complete our syllabus okay so uh, let me tell you that bitset 2022 is scheduled on the last week of june so if we begin in january 2022 we almost have around 6 months to complete our preparation for bitset and from those 6 months we are going to spend 4 months maximum in completing our syllabus completing our syllabus in physics chemistry and maths okay for logical reasoning and english we'll do that in the last 2 months along with uh, our revision and mocks okay now the best way to complete our syllabus i believe is through books okay uh, because if you see uh, as far as i have seen there is no youtube channel which is directly dedicated to bitset okay so going through a youtube channel might be difficult and if you are going to coaching uh, you can refer your coaching modules no need to go through this books okay this is for somebody who is not going through coaching okay so in physics let's get started so in physics these are the books that i want you to refer around this time and that will help you a lot okay so the first book is ncert you just have to read through it it's not that a uh, very good book of a kind uh, just uh, to make you aware of what you are doing just to make you aware of the rules of the game okay so just read the ncert 11th standard and 12th standard now the second and the most important book over here is understanding physics by dc pande i'll put the links of this uh, all these books in the description box of this video you can buy those there okay so from this book you have to study the complete theory okay from theory to level 1 okay so whatever is there between uh, uh, in that book okay so this is one volume of that book it's about waves and thermodynamics so uh, such five books you'll have don't worry you just have to go from theory to level 1 uh, the level 2 you just have to skip you have to skip all the different type of questions which are not according to your bit side pattern like the multiple correct or the or subjective or your uh, match the column those are not there in the chat pattern so you you just have to skip that okay only do the theory and the level 1 uh, multiple choice questions from that book okay also uh, in order to level up now this is uh, this will take care of your bit set easy super easy category easy category easy to easy category okay and yeah easy to moderate but even if you have to go to moderate to difficult category uh this book won't help you so just to level up uh for those 1 to 2% of questions you can refer concepts of physics hcv hc verma okay so that book uh, you don't need to go to the theory now because you already have done the theory to this book and you just have to solve the solved questions and the unsolved questions okay so only for questions you have to re uh, refer concepts of physics okay for theory go through this book and just read ncert that's all you need to do for physics okay now let's get to chemistry i'll also tell you about the revision books the revision books are common for all the three categories so you don't have to worry uh, about going through different books okay so let's get to chemistry now so for chemistry you have to just keep in mind this two books this two books and you are completely ready for bit set okay one is ncert and second is coaching modules okay so first of all you have to study the entire theory from your ncert for chemistry okay and then you have to put yourself to test uh, by solving the questions in the coaching modules now if you go to coaching very good if you don't uh, call up your friends or ask uh, your seniors for the coaching modules okay because uh, ncert is very limited in questions okay so you uh, for practice you just have to refer the questions in the coaching modules okay so you have to solve the questions which are ncert based and the level 1 mcqs okay so from first of all study theory from ncert and then solve questions from uh, the ncert based and the level 1 mcqs from the coaching modules okay 
so that is how you'll prepare for bit set and also while preparing keep this certain things in mind that uh, uh, there are three sections in chemistry organic inorganic physical each one of them almost has an equal weightage in bit set so one third one third one third do not uh, skip any of them okay especially you might uh, feel that inorganic is too boring let's just skip it please don't it accounts for one third or of chemistry right so uh, let's come to uh, some specific points in organic while you are studying uh, the chapters of organic chemistry uh, you have to note down the reactions and mechanism so that you can refer them at end moments okay so two three days before the exams you can just go through the reactions and mechanisms okay uh, those are asked a lot okay so now uh, this book these two books are enough actually for chemistry but if you uh, want to level up okay if you feel this is not enough you can go for ms chauhan for uh, organic chemistry it is a bit leveled up book okay it will prepare you for mains i guess uh, but yeah if you feel this is not sufficient you can go for this book okay otherwise i feel that uh, that this is enough okay now coming to inorganic chemistry here is a good point you can completely rely on ncrt okay for inorganic chemistry completely rely on ncrt uh, make sure you make your personal notes uh, regarding the topics that you tend to forget like some points uh, in in organic chemistry that you might forget just create uh, a page of that just bang it on your wall or your door somewhere so that you see it regularly this might be something very normal to you right you might be doing this uh, throughout this year anyway coming to physical chemistry um, uh, here you have to practice a lot of questions okay so uh, if you feel ncrt the questions in ncrt and the coaching modules are still not enough go for this book called anavasti okay here you can practice a lot of questions uh, for physical chemistry which are important right so these two books are enough for chemistry and these are a few points that you need to keep in mind okay so uh, that will mm, prepare you well for your bit set 2022 in the chemistry section now let's move to maths now coming to maths the good news is that you can skip your ncrt and the only book that you have to refer over here is rd sharma subjective okay so you have to go through the volumes of the 11th standard and 12th standard of rd sharma subjective uh, study everything every aspect of that book the theory the illustrative examples the examples the solved the unsolved examples and the mcqs at the end of each topic okay and i believe that is sufficient for your bit set okay you just have to complete this uh, book in the four months provided to you and uh, that is enough for your bit set preparation also if you feel that uh, some topic the questions are not sufficient in rd sharma so for that specific topic you can go to sengage now sengage is a book uh, which has a collection of different topics okay so it has a pile of questions on a particular topic and it has uh, a book on a particular topic okay so you'll have one book on differential equation one book on your integration so things like that okay so if you want to improve your certain to a topic and if you feel if at all you feel that your preparation in a certain topic is not up to the mark then only go for sengage and refer that particular topic okay refer the book of that particular topic you can solve more questions uh, just for practice okay otherwise i feel rd sharma is sufficient for bit set okay now let's briefly discuss about logical reasoning and english what books to refer and finally we'll go to the revision and the mock part so our last point is revision and mocks which will cover up the last two months of your preparation so first four months you are just completing the syllables and last two months you have to do the revision and you have to practice mocks okay so that is the complete strategy for bit set okay so what are the best books to do a revision for bit set one is the bit set preparation guide which is by arihan publication this is the book okay here you'll find a lot of questions you'll have each chapter okay and with that chapter you'll have some theory and a lot of questions from that chapter okay i would not recommend you going through the theory the theory is just uh very strange okay just go through the questions because the questions are directly based on the bit set pattern okay and don't be scared by this book and the second book that we are going to refer uh, during our revision is bit set 16 years of chapter wise solved papers okay this is by uh disha publication and as the name suggests it's 16 years of 
previous year questions okay so this will help you a lot in understanding the bitset uh, pattern over the last 15 uh, 16 years okay so also i will recommend this book for logical reasoning and english you thought i forgot about it no so uh, you can study logical reasoning and english from this book and from the other book too okay so these are also good books for logical reasoning and english okay so these are the two books that you have to keep in mind also you can follow our channel for um, the last two months because uh, we do some epic stuff we have uh, the previous year question series for bitset uh, the a series it will be continued in january 2022 so there we practice the previous year questions uh, um, in the topic wise right so uh, we have done some videos on it you can surely check those out we'll be continuing it this year the next thing uh, we have with us is the faq series frequently asked question series for bitset so that also will continue in uh, january 2022 uh, we also have with us the logical reasoning and english content which uh, in which every month i provide you in pdf format one question paper that uh, from logical reasoning and english side that you can practice to improve your score in that particular section right so uh, we have planned a lot uh, for bitset 2022 do check out the video that i'll hang up over there okay so yeah that's all for today's video i hope you like the strategy and i hope that you will follow it and get out some fruitful results i'll see you soon in the next video till then Keep enjoying physics and happy strategizing. Bye.